Oh, I can't wait to drink some cold soda. I overheard that you wanted some Coke, didn't you? Actually, yes, I did. <laughs> You'll have to pay. Buy a can of cold Coke right from the fridge. Refreshing soda. You know, Sammy, the job of a salesman is a hard one. You'll get tired real fast. Plus, the customers may not come and your business will fail. And actually, in our AI era, it's not very cool to work behind the counter. Hmm. Huh, you're right. But I wanted to earn some money. Oh, don't worry, I have an idea. Let's make a soda vending machine. It'll give out Coke and collect money in one secure place. Whoa, a vending machine with a money slot? I'm in. Hi, guys. To help Sam make some money on soda, we'll make a vending machine. First, we'll have to make the internal mechanism. How's it going, Shoe? Is it gonna be ready soon? I can't wait! Sammy, I just started. I'm making the first part. Be careful with the cutter, guys. And what's that? A money slot? No, this is the thing to give the soda out. Sue, the can doesn't fit in this tube. You're doing it wrong. <laughs> no, no, it's just a start. These sticks will push out the cans. I already glued them in twos. Almost all of our parts will be made that way. Huh. Interesting. <laughs> What's with this slime? We just started the craft and he's already suspecting something. Together with Sam, we often make cardboard vending machines. Guys, give a thumbs up for our useful hobby. Sam, did you want to help me a little bit? By the mozzarella, you want me to cut out something? <laughs> Wrong guess. I will trust you to a more difficult task. You'll have to cut through these sticks according to the lines. Can you do it? Whoa, that's a new level. I will do it very carefully and won't fail you. In fact, I already cut out, glued, and painted these cardboard pieces myself. <laughs> Each part for the body is made from two layers of cardboard. And these holes are for that tube with sticks. Here is the future window to see our Coke. All these parts should be durable enough to handle several soda cans at once. By the way, the very first machines which sold soda in bottles appeared in only the 1930s. They sold two types of soda. Those were Coca-Cola and Pepsi. I think there are only two types of people. Some just drink Coke and others only Pepsi. There are rumors that the taste differs a lot. Here, the mechanism to hold and give out the cans is ready. A little more. Bring it on! Go glue! And bingo! It was an important moment. Each craft I'm worried about gluing because what's glued can't be removed! Guys, I wait for you to subscribe to our channel and turn on the notifications. Oh, each new craft is super Sammy, exciting. The craft is waiting! Oopsie! I guess I got too much into the video, but they are very interesting indeed. I guess Sam's too busy with sawing the sticks. He's still not here. <laughs> oh, here he comes, and our parts as well. So how did you like the task, Sammy? It, it was just a little challenging, but I managed it, as you can see. You know that challenges make you a little stronger and bring experience, right? Yes, now I can call myself a carpenter, the creator of small cute sticks which remind me of popsicles. You assign professions to yourself so easily. <laughs> yep, assigning professions is easier than sawing thin sticks. <laughs> of course it's easier to say than to do. Do you know who really likes making different cool stuff? Uh, me, you, us? Yeah, us as well, but most of all the Japanese. Do you know how many useful vending machines they have? I came up with a game. You tell me about some machine, and I will have to guess if it's real or not. Let's see how smart I am. Huh, interesting. It's almost like truth or dare. I'm in. I'm ready. Okay, so a tie vending machine. Huh, I think it exists. <laughs> Correct. Next. Hmm, a Lego vending machine. Yep, I saw it on the internet. You can't trick me. Okay, that was easy. Um, a bicycle helmet vending machine? I doubt it, but I would say yes. Right, you can find them in Australia. Bring on the last riddle. Car vending machine. That's ridiculous, so it's not possible. <laughs> You're wrong. They even built a whole vending building for it. The customer inserts a special coin into the slot and the car is given out like a chocolate. <laughs> I still think that you made it up. How can a machine give out a whole car? Let's make a bet. If it's true, then you cut out the rest of the parts. Deal. I'll go Google about the rise of the machine. 
guys. I bet you can't hit the subscribe button really fast. <laughs> and also give a thumbs up so we know that you like our videos. Let's check how our mechanism is functioning. Ding! Hooray! The coin gets into the trap! As you understand, I lost a bet to Sue and cut out parts for the craft. Yep. Car bending machines really do exist. Sammy, thanks for the parts. You did great. Well, if we bet on this kind of work, then I'm okay with that. It's even fun. Even if I lose, it won't be difficult to repay the debt, cause I like cardboard. Once I lost a whole kilo of Nutella and a bet to the Timidabians, that was disappointing. Your gambling nature won't do you any good. What was that bet about? That I can't eat fire or your cookies in a minute without washing them down? They were right, it's impossible. <laughs> the Timidabians played you, Sammy. That's an old prank. No one can eat so many cookies without any liquid. Those Timidabians are big jokers, and Sam falls for it. <laughs> I have a delicate and naive soul, and I like taking risks. <laughs> oh, Sammy, you're a better pranker than any of the Timidabians. Sometimes I'm shocked by your jokes. But it was so funny when you applied toothpaste instead of cream on your hands. Yeah, that was amusing, but I also played a good joke on you. Remember? Yeah, I still remember that bowl of marbles instead of candies. You wrapped them so nicely and I couldn't understand why the candies were not sweet and didn't melt in my mouth. Sammy, could you bring me a can of Coke from your store? I need to test the mechanism. Oopsie, I almost drank everything. I totally forgot that we have to fill the vending machine. Oh, how many cans did we lose? Uh, just three. I used them to wash down the cookies. My throat was all dry. Oh, so it's the cookies' fault. Okay, how many do we have? Six, I think. Yeah, cookies are very dangerous. They get into your throat and stick there if you don't wash it down. I think that'll be enough. Look how our mechanism is working. The coin gets here, and then I press the button. Guys, note that smaller change does not work. A can of Coke costs 50 cents. And now, we'll make a slide for the coin. This way, they'll get into the mechanism. Just a couple of touches, and now we install it and make sure that the coin falls into the right place. We hide the mechanism from prying eyes. A book is judged by its cover, and crafts as well. And the responsible person for the cover is our great decorator. Here he is. Well, I'm tired of watching the coins fall into nowhere. Take this box. It's so adorable, but it can't fit a lot of coins. Then we'll just take them out more often and spend on Coke. A cycle. Sammy, all you do is take money out from piggy banks. They're actually meant for saving money. Whoosh. You know, Sue, sometimes I walk by one of your piggy banks and get totally enchanted. You make them so cool and beautiful. <laughs> You're such a flatterer, Sammy. And then it's like a delusion. I wake up with a handful of coins and I hear them whispering, Spend us, spend. <laughs> Sammy, you defo have a wild imagination. Sure, I check out my idea of craft decoration. Oh, a template. I guess we've never done it this way. <laughs> Let's try. Guys, remember that you need a good ventilated room to work with spray paint. Better do it outside, and don't forget to protect your clothes, hands, and face from the paint. It spreads really fast and really far. I think we're getting something awesome. I love it. Thumbs up for Sam's brilliant decoration ideas. And a bit more. I can't wait to see the result. It's time for our Coke cans. We load them inside. Great. We loaded the machine and prepared the coins. Dear friends, we are here today to celebrate the opening of the new vending machine by Sam and Sue Industrial. A round of applause! So, shall we test our machine in action? This is for me. Yum yum. Wow! A Coke fountain! <laughs> and this is mine! Ah, we did great. Now we need a good rest. Do you agree? Give a thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye bye! Cheers! Bye bye! Hi guys! Today we're gonna make a minion fountain machine for soda. Isn't that great? Sammy, could you please bring me a popsicle stick? I knew you were gonna need it. Here! Thank you, Sammy. You are always ready to help. 
Now we need to apply some glue here. And just a blob there. Guys, be very careful with the glue gun. It's very hot. Safety comes first, my friends. You're right, Sammy. As I see, you've taken all the precautions. That is so smart of you. There's no machine without wires, right? Be careful with the soldering iron. Use it only under adult supervision. I was wondering, maybe you want to see a little trick? <laughs> wow, so neat. I wanted to make the same piece by myself. Did I do good? <laughs> Sammy, you're my great helper, of course. But look closely. Oh, I forgot the popsicle stick. But if you wait, I'll, I'll just... No, Sammy, it's okay. I know what to do. Hmm. I need something to secure these somehow. Will this work? Oh, perfectly. Thank you. Let's put these rubber bands here. Sweet. I know that you're gonna need this next. And right you are again. Guys, we need to make an opening in this plastic lid. We'll use an owl. There we go. Now let's make some noise. Ask an adult to help you with the drill. We need to insert this into the opening. Thank you, Sammy. Actually, how did you know? Ah, we've made a fountain machine before. Guys, you can find that video on our channel. And here's the glue once again. It's important to seal the edges so our soda doesn't leak. There we go. Be very careful. The glue gun is not a toy. And it's done. So guys, everything's ready for the next step. Wait, it's important to do a test run. Here, I've prepared everything. Oh, thank you. You're right, Sammy. We need to make sure that there are no leaks. All right, we assembled the first chain. We need to connect the tube and the pump. We need to test the pump, too. So I brought something. Wow, awesome. It's like you have a sixth sense. Now we'll insert this part into the bottle and close the lid. Okay, guys, are you ready? Let's roll! Whoa! Let's make a nice case for our machine so that we can hide all the content. For this, we need to make little pieces like this. I hope nobody here is against craft magic. Yay! And this is a little switch. That goes right here. Perfect. Okay, all right, uh-huh. Sue, wanna see a trick too? Oh sure, go ahead, Sammy. Make way for Craft Master Sam! Done! Whoa, great job, Sammy. We only need to set pumps and a battery. But first, we need to cover the wires. Right. We'll do it using this piece with a little opening for the switch. It goes right here. And we'll pull the wires through it this way. Sue, check out what I made. Let me see. This piece looks funny, like a snout. But actually, it plays an important role. It covers and protects the wires. And here comes the second wire, whoosh! And it's done! Sammy, did you do that? <laughs> I was not alone! <laughs> I think I know who helped you. You look just like one of them. Only you're pink. That was the whole point. But the minions went off to do their business. Well, something important is waiting for us, too. Let's start building the walls for our machine. We'll begin with the front wall, but I think we need to decorate it beforehand. Hmm. Sammy, do you have any ideas? Banana, banana, ba, na, na! Oh, right. We need palm trees and something for the beach. I think this will do. Just perfect. Sue, I'm done. It seems like I've got minion fever. Stop panicking, Sammy. You'd better come and help me. Let's build up more walls. Hey, Sammy, how are you there? Phew, I feel energetic and pink again. And I can't wait to see the results. Me too, Sammy. I think it's gonna be really great. All right, let's insert the tubes. Awesome. Uh, Sue, help me. Oh, sure. Oh, that was close. Oh, I think it's too heavy for you. Don't you remember what happened last time? 
Let's take two more. It's always nice to have a choice. Ready to have fun, guys? Wow, that was cool, right? Yeah, Sue, that's what I call magic. Thank you, that's so nice of you to say. Oh, I know what I can do while you're busy here. And done. Oh, that's even better. Sue, check out what I made. Wow, you did great, Sammy. <laughs> Thanks to these stickers, we know what we'll be putting in our glasses. This one goes here, Coke, Sprite is the second one, and this is the place for Fanta. As you know, minions are small, but rather stout creatures shaped like a capsule or a soda can. I thought it would be convenient to hide the chain inside it. Huh, that's a good idea. Oh. Sue, I noticed two holes in the bottom. I guess you need to take another can. You're very attentive to the details. This is an important feature for a craft master. But everything is thought through, Sammy. You'll see it later. Sue, uh, help. I have a little problem here. Oh, you are tangled again. Oof, thanks, Sue. It will look better on the can. What do you think? Whoosh. Awesome. Yeah. Well, at least I can move freely now. And dance. ba 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 da ba Sue, there's no time for games. A little bit of fun won't do any harm. We'll insert the wire. And the legs are set. Sammy, did you do that? Of course. Who else? I don't waste time on games, you know. Would you look at this serious slime? Work hard, play harder, right? Well, yes. I can't argue with that. I decided to clean up a bit. Do we need this for the craft? Yeah, you're just in time. Now let's attach the wires and hide this in one of the minions. La 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 la, uh, oh, what's this? I've been looking for them. We need these lids for the craft. By the way, Sammy, do you like making crafts all by yourself from scratch? Such a responsibility, right? Maybe you've forgotten, Sue, but I'm a craft master. Oh, I'm sorry, great master. I never doubted your skills. What's the most important thing for a craft master? Firm hands, of course. <laughs> That's right. Will you need the rest of them, too? Of course. Each of our minions will need his arms. That's how they'll help pour soda. Then I'm sending these arms to the minions. Whoop. Yep. That's exactly what I meant. Great job, Sammy. So, I designed the final look of our craft. Are you ready for the presentation? Yes, I can't wait to see it. The main idea of this craft is tropical holidays. After a long hard crafting, everybody needs a rest. There is nothing better on a hot summer day than a light breeze. And a cold refreshing soda. May I add some flowers, Sammy? Hmm. Yes, you may. Yes, yes, that's exactly what I had in mind. You did a great job, Sammy. I'm really impressed. And thanks for letting me add some details. It came out so wonderful. My work is done here. Wait for me. I'll get glasses. While Sam's off, let's take a closer look at our craft. Well, Sammy, are you ready to test our minion machine? Of course I am! Which one do you want to try? Sue, just pour me something. I'm thirsty. As you wish. How much longer, Sue? I can't wait anymore! There you go. Thanks, Sue. While Sammy is busy, I'll pour some for myself, too. Mmm, it's gonna be so great. All right. Sue, so can I get a refill? You already finished? Mix them all! There, Sammy, take it. Thanks. Guys, if you like this craft as much as I do, give us a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit the bell button so you don't miss our next video. And subscribe to our channel. 
Bye, guys. See you soon, boys and girls.